Hello and welcome to a quick video on conditional formatting. Conditional formatting will format cells based off of specific criteria or based off of certain conditions. Here we have a quick inventory list from a grocery store, no big deal. We're going to look at our price. We're going to highlight the column price. We're going to make sure we're at the home ribbon and over here under conditional formatting we have several options. We can do highlight cells that are greater than, less than, between certain numbers, equal to certain numbers or text. Uh, if it's text, a date, if there's duplicate values, we can do the top uh, 10 items, top 10%, bottom 10 items, above average, below average. There's a bunch of different options here, even the possibility of us making our own rules. But real quickly here, we're gonna say, highlight cells that are greater than, let's just say anything greater than $9.99. We want to mark, fill that with yellow and dark yellow text. We say OK. And we scroll down and we can see that we have two items here, beer and wine, that are greater than $9.99. If we look at the quantity, do conditional formatting, and we can do the top 10 items. It'll show us the highest prices. And you can change this number to any number greater than 10. We'll say we want to make those green. And OK. We can also manage that rule and let's delete that rule delete this rule apply let's highlight the top 10 percent of items and so it'll look through here and we want to make those green so this is based off of quantity top 10 percent items um, based simply off of quantity Another really useful one, just as a data validation type of tool for conditional formatting, is duplicate values. So we don't want it to delete necessarily conditional or duplicate values, but we want to be aware that they exist. And so under conditional formatting, highlight duplicate values, and I'm going to make those red and say OK. And so now we can see here in this situation, we have two food items called Hot Pockets. Um, one of them has 160 in stock and the other has 55. One charges $2.25 and one charges $5.45. This doesn't necessarily mean that we have a duplicate value in our inventory. It just means we have a duplicate value in our um, list and we may have to do some further explanation. So again, conditional formatting, just a set of rules that will format cells based off of uh, different criteria. 